Hey YouTube, happy November. I'm here this time with my one month update for my finish 18 by 2018 challenge. If you are not familiar with my challenge, I will link my intro video down below. But essentially what I'm doing is I am collaborating with one of my favorite YouTubers. Her name is Alexis. I will also link her channel down below. And my side of our challenge is my Bath & Body Works collection. So my challenge is to finish up 18 Bath & Body Works items by the beginning of 2018. And she's actually on the wax side. So if you like my channel or if you like wax, or both, make sure that you check her out and don't forget to subscribe to her channel too. So what I'm going to do is just go through and update you on what I've finished, what I haven't even started, you know, whatever. So I will do this video and um, in October empties. So in this video, I won't give you actual reviews. So make sure that you check out my empties video, which will feature a couple other Bath & Body Works items not in the project for full reviews. So just saying, make sure that you're subscribed to my channel. Again, subscribe uh, subscribe to Alexis's channel too. And yeah, so if you guys have watched my channel, you know that I have been in Wichita or I was in Wichita for two weeks in October. So I did finish up a couple of items from my challenge that I recycled in Wichita to save room in my bag. So the first two items that I finished up were a full-size body cream in Peony and also the Body Splash in Peony. So that Body Splash is not a fine fragrance mist, but I'm telling you, a Body Splash from uh, Bath & Body Works Pleasures Collection. So those are out. I do love Peony. However, I do have a backup set of it, so I'm really not like devastated to have those gone. So the next two things I finished up are my set in Mango Mandarin. I have my full size lotion and the fine fragrance mist. So those are out. You'll notice that I have lines on some things and not on others. If I don't have a line on um, like any bottle, that means that I started out with it new, but this is my only exception. So if you watch my intro video, and again, I'll link it down below. I was about halfway done with this mist and most of the way done with this lotion, but for everything else, if there's no line, I started it new. So just saying. Okay, something I also finished up is a shower gel in Velvet Tuberose. This is my second favorite fragrance of all time from Bath & Body Works. It is amazing. I'm sad to have this gone, but I do have two more backups that I'll be using in 2018. Oh no, phone battery's gonna die. We'll speed through. Okay, I also finished up a mini, uh, a mini EDT in Waikiki Beach Coconut, and I've got one more in my challenge. I also finished up, oh, I dropped it. Anyway, I finished up a Tutti Dolce body cream in White Mocha Kiss. I just purchased it this year as it came out earlier this year. Um, however, I mentioned in my intro video that the reason why I wanted to use it up and have it be gone is because it's yellow and I cannot get down with a yellow cream. I don't do that. So that's it. Speaking of yellow creams, I also used to have my mini in Waikiki Beach Coconut. This was also a mini body cream that I used up with that mini EDT. I finished up my Paris Springtime in Paris pocket back. I finished up my Sweetest Strawberries um, hand cream, just one ounce, $4 for one ounce. Just saying. Mm. Can't deal with that. And also I finished up my London tea and lemon candles. So even though it is wax and Alexis is doing the wax side, I figured that this would still be appropriate since it is Bath and Body Works. Otherwise it definitely would not have been in there. Okay, so for the things that I have started using up that I'm not completely done with, I've got two creams, one in Beautiful Day and the other in Georgia Peach and Sweet Tea. So the lines are just showing you where I'm at. So with creams, the way that I figured that is I just um, squeezed them out and stopped when they started coming out of the bottle. And that's where I figured where I am with how much I've used up. So not really a whole lot here with Beautiful Day. A little bit with Georgia Peach and Sweet Tea, but still hardly anything. So expect definitely one of these in my second update, but maybe not both. I also started both my fine fragrance mist that I have left. My beautiful day is a little bit more of a third of the way through. And then I have a little tiny dent in Twisted Peppermint. 
And then finally, the two other items besides the other mini EDT and Waikiki Beach Coconut that I haven't even started yet is this Aloha. Um, again, this is a hand cream. It's nice packaging, like a nice picture, but I just, I don't like the screw on and screw off cap. And the other one is my full size lotion in Twisted Peppermint. So um, this you probably won't even see until the end of the project. Same with my Twisted Peppermint Fine Fragrance Mist because this is like my December fragrance. But definitely be on the lookout for that beautiful day and maybe even my George Peach and Sweet Tea in my next um, update. So like I said, I kind of sped through this partly because of my battery, but also because they're really not reviews here. Make sure that you check out my actual October empties video. It'll be a really good one. So stay tuned for that. Don't forget to subscribe to Alexis's channel, to mine. Please like and comment. And finally, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at yellowbrickexpat. Same way I spelled here. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.